Hello and welcome to Dr. Malpani's YouTube channel. Don't forget to hit that subscribe button as well as the bell icon so that you can be notified about new videos. Many IVF clinic websites are selling PGS, PGD or PGT, pre-implantation genetic testing to their patients by claiming that it increases pregnancy success rates, lowers the risks of miscarriage and avoids the time and expense of multiple IVF cycles. However, the website of Britain's Human Fertilization and Embryology Authority, which regulates IVF medicine in the UK, clearly states that there is limited evidence for those claims. The dilemma posed by Mosaic Embryos has muddied the water so much that Pascal Patrizio, Head of Fertility Medicine at Yale University, and Sherman Silber of St. Luke's Hospital in St. Louis recently suggested that perhaps the best advance now for IVF is to take a step backward and simply transfer day five embryos without testing them first, predicting rates of live births and pregnancies will quickly surge as a result. Glyco estimates that the increased transfer of mosaic embryos, embryos that only a few years ago would have been discarded, could yield thousands of additional IVF babies each year, especially in older women who don't produce normal embryos. The problem is that you may be throwing away embryos which were reported as being abnormal by PGT, but which could have become healthy babies, because embryos can self-correct. Please don't waste your money and reduce your chances of getting pregnant by doing PGS. More is not always better. You can read more about this by visiting www.drmalpani.com.